So you like cool shirts, do you? Do you like discounts? Oh yeah, I know you do. So I got a little care package now. Before this video starts, this won't take long. I promise. Gentlemen's Driving Club was so kind to hook me up with a little care package. They sent on over this keychain, this awesome ass shirt, which fits nice and it's very high quality, by the way. Gentlemen'sDrivingClub.com. If you use the promo code 37, which should be right here, right in the screen, use promo code 37, 20% off the first purchase. Highly recommend these guys because this shirt is badass. I had an MPT shirt that's all worn out now. I was in the market for some new apparel, and guess what? Beyond 37 on YouTube hooked me up with this badass stuff. So again, 37 promo code. Go to Gentlemen's Driving Club. Check them out on Instagram also. Gentlemen'sDrivingClub.com promo code 37 20% off. Awesome stuff. Thank you so much Beyond 37 for sending this. Check out his channel in the link below. Check out their apparel site in the link below. Check out their Instagram in the link below. Thank you so much for you guys for sending me this stuff. I really appreciate what you did. And uh, again, enjoy this video. Enjoy all of my videos. Hopefully you do. And uh, yeah. Do I know how to drive a stick? Dude, I drive 18 wheelers in my sleep. <laughs> you guys didn't know. I hold the record for the fastest shifting ever. Did it get us both the record? So fast, so fucking fast. Downshift, I can downshift faster. Oh shit. That's fucking fast. And nobody can shift as fast. Shifter, bro. Bah. But can you do this?
Better make sure. Pushes the shifter down to switch gears. That doesn't. You're lying, bro. Why are you always lying? See, if you really want your car to last, you need to be careful not to be close to the red line when you shift because that's when your engine fails. It's nothing to do with anything else, just you can't get anywhere near red line. So let's do a poll. I'm going to show you how I made my fastest pass. That's how you gotta do it. That's how that's how I trap my 
fastest miles per hour, guys. Don't you don't want to ride out the, the RPMs. You want to shift as quick and as low as possible because you want to save your engine. We drag race it takes a lot of a lot of stress on the engine, so I want to make sure that we're we're not we're not taking too much of a toll on the engine. You know, it doesn't go into second gear. All right, we're going to shift to five, maybe four and a half. RPM. That is a pull and a half right there. That is a pull and a half. Just making sure it's in neutral. A bit no lift action. <laughs> Get whiplash, man. But that's cool because we're no lifting. No lifting, that's all that matters. I know you won't burn up your clutch from no lifting, you'll actually save your clutch. I don't know how, but you'll save your clutch, okay? Just, just I'm a pro, I'm a professional, I'm a professional, okay? Just listen to me. Ah! Don't get with these fucking cup holders. Who invented this shit? Just buy a small, just buy a small size. I don't want a fucking small, okay? I like a lot of coffee. I like a lot of coffee. Sometimes it gets in the fucking way. This is fucking retarded. I got a shit like this. It's, ow, it's fucking burning my arm, too. You know what? I'm gonna sue Ford because my fucking arms burn because it has to lay over my hot fucking coffee, shit my fucking gear. And you know what? There's nothing I can fucking do about it. I can't put it in the seat, can't put it on the floor, can't put it in the rustles. It's fucking spill everywhere. It's fucking bullshit. It's like it was 10th coffee today. They have to make way, way too many coffees, way too many coffees. But you know what? I don't care. I just really don't care because right now I just really want to drive my car. I want to shift. I want to go way fast. And I can't because it's really snowing outside. But you know what? I really don't think I've had too much coffee anymore. I think this is a really good idea because it's a good video. It's coming out really good. You know what? I had Starbucks three times and then I went to Dunkin' Donuts right after with Starbucks. And then this time, it's like my arms really burn because all the times I pull my cup holder, cup, cup in the holder, and then, um, yeah, let's shift, and now I'm shifting funny, and I'm missing gears, and my transmission's damaged, and I'm gonna sue everybody for it, but you know what? I just wanna really make a better cup holder. I don't think I've had too many coffees today, do you? I drink a lot of coffee. 37 likes a cup, 37 really likes this fucking cup. A lot.